Hello friends, in this video we will talk about the variation of frequency uh, with the stopping potential. Okay, The experimental arrangement for uh, this will be similar to the previous one. Now what exactly we are doing in this procedure is, we are keeping the intensity of light constant. Remember, we are keeping the intensity of light constant and now the variation of current with the potential. You know the behavior of this, alright. Uh, graph thoda sa galat hai, so let me correct it. It goes like this, like this, like this and then it saturates, right? As you increase the potential, the value of electric current also increases in this. Now, before I start explaining this graph, agar aap Einstein ki photoelectric equation dimaag mein rakhenge, to samajna aasan hoga. The equation is this, H nu that means the total energy of photon it is divided into two parts the first part is equal to the work function which is the energy required to kick an electron out of the metal surface plus the remaining energy becomes the kinetic energy of electron okay abhi suno is equation mein thoda sa change karne wala hu what is that change See, energy of photon remains H nu, no problem with that. Work function remains work function that is W0 plus instead of kinetic energy, I am writing EV, electron volt. What I am writing? Electron volt. Abhi maine kinetic energy ko electron volt kaise likh diya? Iske piche ka logic samaj lo ek bar. See, according to electrostatics, the potential energy of any charge is given as Q into V, right? That means if you put a charge Q inside or in between a potential difference V, then the energy of that charge becomes Q into V, okay? A charge hai, aapne usko potential difference V ke beech mein chalaya, to usko kitni energy milegi? Equal to Q into V. Ab mein aapse poochta hoon ki ye energy kya ban jayegi? This energy will become the kinetic energy of the object. This is actually the potential energy. But when you give this electron this much energy, the electron takes it as its kinetic energy. Ye kya ban jati hai? Electron ki kinetic energy ban jati hai. Theek hai? Now the electron is moving with some kinetic energy. Now if I want to stop that electron, if I want to stop that electron, then how much energy I should give to it? Exactly this amount of energy, मुझे इतनी ही energy देनी पड़ेगी, मतलब negative energy थी देनी पड़ेगी उस electron को रोकने के लिए, ठीक है? अगर मैं electron को accelerate करवाता हूँ, with a potential difference V, the charge of electron is E, then the kinetic energy of electron will be E V. अब मुझे उसकी kinetic energy को zero करना है, so instead of positive potential, I will be giving it negative potential, okay? पहले इसके पास एनर्जी कितनी थी EV अब उसको नेगेटिव पोटेंशियल दूंगा एनर्जी कितनी हो जाएगी माइनस EV टोटल एनर्जी कितनी हो जाएगी जीरो डिड यू गेट दैट सो इन दिस वे वी आर स्टॉपिंग द इलेक्ट्रॉन एमीटर से जो इलेक्ट्रॉन निकलता है उसे कलेक्टर पे जाने से रोकने के लिए वी हैव टू गिव द स्टॉपिंग पोटेंशियल टू द इलेक्ट्रॉन एंड दैट स्टॉपिंग पोटेंशियल इज कमिंग फ्रॉम दिस लॉजिक ओके नाउ सी व्हाट वी आर डूइंग this graph we have already studied in topic number uh, one or two that is the uh, graph of current versus potential difference current flowing in this circuit and potential difference that is applied from here what is this v0 this v0 is known as the stopping potential okay so here shall i write v0 because if electron is having kinetic energy equals to ev then the uh, energy required to stop that electron will be ev0 where is that EV0 in the graph? It is over here. Now what I am doing, मैं ये जो radiation यहाँ से आ रहा है, इसकी frequency को increase कर देता हूँ. What I am doing? I am increasing the frequency of light. All right? Numbers में इसको समझ लेते हैं. कोई भी metal पकड़ लो, ठीक है? तो उसका work function आप ले लो three. कितना work function ले लो three, ठीक है ना? Photon की energy कितनी ले लो ten ले लो. Okay, what about the remaining 7? This was the total energy of photon. 3 was the work function. That means this was the energy required by the electron to move out. 
and 7 became the kinetic energy of electron okay and this stopping potential v0 this represents what this represents this number now if i increase the energy of photons yahan se jo photons aa rahe hain i am increasing the energy that means i am increasing what i am increasing the frequency because energy of photon is given as h into nu so to increase the energy i have to do what i have to increase the frequency okay now suppose i have increased the frequency and i have made it 12 i have made it 12 will the work function change no it is the same metal in the same condition so work function is not going to change so what is going to change is this this will become 9 yani agar aap photon ki energy badate hain to work function to utna hi rehta hai electron ki kinetic energy bad jati hai yani usko rokne ke liye ab aapko pehle se zyada negative potential provide karna padega okay intensity humne change nahi ki hai so saturation current will remain same but now because you require more energy to stop that electron the stopping potential will have a new value over here isko v01 bol dete hain isko bol dete hain v02 got it now what if i decrease the energy of photon ab main photon ki energy ko decrease kar deta hu pehle 10 tha abhi 12 kiya ab main isko kar deta hu 9 right i am changing the frequency of radiation in order to change the energy of photon so the new energy of photon is 9 is the work function going to change no the same metal same conditions work function remains same what will happen the kinetic energy of electron is going to change how much it will be 6 so abhi jo electron yahan se niklega uski kinetic energy kitni hogi पहले से कम तो उसको रोकने के लिए जो स्टॉपिंग पोटेंशियल चाहिए वो कितना होगा वो भी पहले से कम होगा ठीक है क्योंकि आई हैव नॉट चेंज द इंटेंसिटी द सैचुरेशन करंट रिमेन सेम बट हियर व्हाट विल हैपन द स्टॉपिंग पोटेंशियल इज गोइंग टू डिक्रीज आई कॉल दिस v03 गेटिंग इट so it is the same graph of current versus potential which i have drawn for three different frequencies as you increase the frequency stopping potential is going to increase if you decrease the frequency the stopping potential is going to decrease 